right. They didn't have masks when Jesus was here. Jesus was here. We have our own system for a Jesus. reason. Exactly. If you've got the spirit of Jesus in you and around us, and we do, in America, we do. We do. God is with us. We don't always get it right. No. We ain't always doing right. That's we right. all know we do our own thing, right? But that's why God is love. That's why God is here. He's delivered this nation for us to live free, man. The gospel will be spread by truth, justice, and liberty. That's how the gospel is spread. Hey guys, I do have, I do have Cast a... Cast off all fear, man. Cast it off. I have an action list. I'm going to ask each of you to do this, okay? Next week, I want you to all call your sheriffs. Yes. I want you to call okay. your counties. I want you to start mobilizing your counties. That is the most important thing we can do right now, is voicing our... our our displeasure to our sheriffs and telling them we will not comply with unconstitutional law enforcement orders. Uphold your oath of office as the sheriff and the highest law of the land and, and obey and follow and enforce the Constitution as the highest law of this land. That is number one. Please, if every one of us, all 85,000 plus of us, plus all everybody else that's here today, did that, we would have a very strong and loud voice. They would not be able to silence us. But we have to all speak out in unison. The next thing I want you to do, everywhere you go, I want you to be freedom on your lips. Freedom on your lips. Everywhere you go. Talk about freedom. Talk about it at your church. Talk about it at your talk about it at your bank. Everywhere I go, you know what I do? I go in without my mask on because I've not worn one yet. So I go in without my mask on. And I smile at everybody I see. I say, hey, how you doing today? It's a great day to be alive, right? Because I'm not going to live in fear. I'm not going to live in fear. God has not given me a spirit of fear. So I'm going to live free until I'm not living anymore. Because all this mess of living in fear, fear is the real virus. And I know for a fact the Word tells us 370 times or so not to fear. So whatever you think of the Bible, I'm going to think that that's probably got some truth to it, right? Right? Okay. So let's stay free because that is the best thing you can do is be a beacon of freedom in your town, in your home, in your neighborhood, in your household, everywhere you go. And people will say, yeah, like I get it all the time. You're not wearing a mask. No, you're not. I'm not going to either. I'm free. I'm healthy. I have an immune system. So let's do that. Let's be spreaders of the truth. God bless each and every one of you for being here today. I appreciate you so much.